Let's go a little north in Florida. Buccaneers receiver Antonio Brown has been accused of obtaining a fake COVID-19 vaccination card. That's according to the Tampa Bay Times. The league is obviously going to look into it. How might they handle the situation, Dan? So the, the way it works with the vaccination proof is it's on the teams to verify it. And so if uh, he, he does have a forge or fake vaccine card, uh, it will be the Tampa Bay Buccaneers will be held responsible for not verifying that. Now, of course, so will the player. Uh, the league will look into this. It has said as much. Uh, obviously, if there's, a, if there's a forgery or a fake, then he would be subject to discipline under the personal conduct policy. Uh, but as was pointed out to me a couple times last night, forgery or faking a, a vaccine card is also a federal offense uh, that could yeah. carry uh, actual jail time. I don't think that's likely, but it's something that um, if there's evidence that he did that, he could be looking at trouble with the federal government as well as the NFL. So again, it's that report. He has denied it. It's important for us to say that. The Buccaneers say there have been no irregularities with their vaccination uh, verification procedures. So we'll see what happens when the league starts digging in. Brown has not played since week six because of a foot injury, but obviously now a couple of other issues that he will be dealing with. Dan Graziano with the latest from around the league. Thank you. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.